What's up guys? So in this video, I'll be showing you how you can recover your data from a dead laptop. So if you have a dead laptop like this, do not panic. This video is for you and make sure to watch this video till the end so that you see all the steps. And for you to be able to recover your data from a dead laptop, you need this connection, this SATA to USB cable. You can get this uh, cable from any computer shop. It's, it costs about $20. So you can just go and look for a SATA to USB cable. This is all you need for you to be able to recover your data from your dead laptop. And also, you need a screwdriver. All right, okay, let's go into the details. So now let's open our laptop. So you go in the back. Here, the back way, you see this partition here. So this is where our hard drive is. So we are going to remove our hard drive and try to connect it to another working computer so that we can be able to retrieve our data from that dead laptop, from this dead laptop. All right, okay, so usually there will be one screw or maybe two, so there's a screw here, so I'm going to unscrew that using my screwdriver. All right, now it's loose, and then now I'll use a flat screwdriver to just remove this. Usually it will be having contacts, so you have to be careful. So these are the contacts that will be holding it. So you just uh, use a flat screwdriver. That shouldn't uh, be hard. Okay. So here is our hard drive. So this is where all the information that we need is. Okay. There are some hard drives that will be having screws. So just go ahead and uh, unscrew those screws. With mine, I've opened this uh, laptop before. So there are no screws inside. So now let's remove our hard drive. So you come here now and then you just apply pressure on both sides after removing those screws. And then you push. Not too much, just lightly. And then now our hard drive is off. And then carefully, you pick it up carefully. And then you hold on the sides, not on the actual surface. Just hold on them, on the sides like this. And then now you can connect this one now. Okay. And now that we have removed our hard drive, now let's connect it to our SATA cable. So this is the male side and this is the female side. And carefully, we connect like this. And remember, you have to hold your hard drive on the ends so as to avoid static electricity from your hands. And then now you place your hard drive on any object that does not carry any current. So I'll use this book. So I'll carefully put my hard drive on top of this book. And then the USB cable now, I'll insert it carefully onto the working laptop. Okay, so this is how you do the connection. So after connecting our hard drive to any working computer, now you go to this PC and then as you can see here, we have two hard drives that are connected here. We have this one, the ESA one. This is the one that is working in this computer. And then the uh, this one, uh, D, this is the one that we are connecting externally. This is the hard drive that came from our dead computer. So for you to retrieve your files, you just come here and then you click on that hard drive that is connected externally. And then these are all the folders that are in our hard drive. So now let's go to users. And then we you go to this user. This was the main user on the on our dead laptop. So as you can see that here we can go to our desktop and see what was on the desktop. So all these files, all this file we on our desktop on are from the dead computer. And then we can also go to another folder. Let's go to my documents. So these are the files that were in our dead computer. So when you want to save these files now in your working computer, all you need to do is to drag and drop. So I can drag this one and drop it in my desktop, the desktop of the working computer now. Okay, so this is it. So this is it, guys. This is how you can recover your data from a dead laptop. Okay, so if you have any questions or any contribution that you want to make, please go down there on the comment section and leave your comments. And if this was your first time coming to this channel, go down there as well and click on subscribe and also hit the notification bell so that you'll see all our future videos. Bye for now and see you on our next video. Ciao.